All right, what's up, guys? Today we're gonna be making a fart G line. So basically, if you click the button, it's gonna do a fart. So you get the point. Let's get straight into the video. All right, so what we're gonna start off with, we're gonna go to the starter GUI, insert a screen GUI, you don't have to name that, and into that screen GUI, just add a frame. And we can just drag this frame along so it could look like this. Let's maybe scale it a little bit. All right, there we go. So it's gonna be like this. We have the, if you guys wanna record it down, we have the size right here. And we also have the position right here, so I'll, I'll take like five seconds. All right, we can uh, get this frame color really right here. We can like, get it a bright green, and into that frame we can do a text button. And since if you copied and pasted that, so basically you gotta copy and paste the position right here. But I think it's in the same position, so I don't have to do that. So you go to the size, copy and paste the size. Whoops. I'm going to control Z really quick. Copy and paste the size, put it in the text button. And nice. Now we can change the background color to different green, maybe. And then after that, we can make sure text is scaled. And you don't have to change the font. I'm just going to do it because I like to. And we'll just do bark. And we also change the color of this. Like that. Yeah, I think that's good. Kind of like a goldish, brownish color. Then we can rename the text button to... Fart GY and into that fart actually actually not in the fart GY we'll actually we'll have the script right now but we're not gonna be using the script. And let's go back to the base plate and into workspace you're gonna want to add a let's find a sound. Find a sound. In uh, right here I think I have whoops. But here I have uh, my Roblox page and everything, so I can just go to audio, search that, and select it in library. Press away. Okay. And then after that, we, we can click that arrow and go to audio. And we can say fart. And we can choose any kind of fart. We can use this part, we can use this part, and we can use this one. Depends which one you like better. I'm going to use this one right here. So you don't have to click on get, you can just get this number up here in the link. And let's get this number right here, control C. And then in the sound, we can, we can rename the sound, we can rename it to part. Sound and into the fart sound, you can right here it says sound ID, and we can paste that number in there. And when you click on the preview, you should hear that sound. And we can put the volume maybe like 10, something like that. Let's just put it at 8.5, 8.7. So then, yeah. So now we can go back to the local script. Let's name this local script part as script. And into the fart script, we can open that. We can say local. We can do local. Um, maybe we can do fart GUI equals script dot parent. Dot parent. Alright, and I think and we can do also local part equals 
workspace dot fart sound. And now we can do fart GUI dot mouse button one click colon connect function inside of those brackets. And then we can say fart. We can say fart colon play. Whoops. And that should be about it. So now if we go back to the base play, start the game. Yeah. Uh, we can let me clear my output right here. If now we select fart, you can hear the sound. And that's for today's episode. Make sure you like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.